हेलो स्टूडेंट्स वेलकम टू माय चैनल एग्रीकल्चर इन ऑनलाइन लेट अस सॉल्व अनदर प्रॉब्लम फ्रॉम गेट 2017 क्वेश्चन नंबर 38 ए ट्रैक्टर ऑफ 19.5 किलो न्यूटन वेट एंड 1.8 मीटर व्हील बेस इज 70 परसेंट स्टैटिक वेट ऑन रियर एक्सेल इट पुल्स 8 किलो मीटर ड्रोवर लोड पैरेलल टू द ग्राउंड थ्रू ए हिच पॉइंट लोकेटेड 450 मिलीमीटर अबव द ग्राउंड द डायनेमिक वेट ऑन द रियर एक्सेल ऑफ द ट्रैक्टर अंडर ऑपरेटिंग कंडीशन इन किलो न्यूटन विल बी डेस सो दिस इज अ वेरी सिंपल प्रॉब्लम वेयर एक्चुअली यू नीड टू फाइंड आउट द वेट ट्रांसफर and you can calculate the dynamic weight so let us see this is the condition for this one there is uh, pull of the tractor is let it be it's given it is 8 kN and uh, let us say the wheel base is x that is given that is uh, 1.8 meter and uh, 70% of the weight is distributed at the uh, rear wheel initially so the tractor weight is it's 19.5 let it 19.5 kilo newton so since start uh, 70% is uh, distributed at the rear wheel initially uh, in static condition there is therefore a static weight uh, initially let it uh, wr that will be equal to uh, 70% that is 0.7 into 19.5 kilo newton That will be equal to 13.65 kilonewton. It's a simple step forward. And coming to the next, uh, when there is pull of 8 kilonewton and the pull is having a uh, height that is y1. Let it be in this case. Y1 is given 450 millimeter or 0.45 meter. therefore uh, since it's given 0.45 meter we know the weight transfer so weight transfer due to due to pull we can say it's very simple let it change in uh, weight transfer del w let it be that will be equal to py1 by x so this is the very simple if you know the weight transfer if there is no other things are given and it's uh, the pull is uh, straight forward horizontal if it's uh, any any angle is here then that will be py1 uh, cos theta or cos alpha whatever but uh, in this case it's a straight forward horizontal uh, parallel is there parallel drawer pull is here therefore it's very straight forward therefore the change in uh, weight or weight transfer will be equal to p p is 8 into y1 is 0.45 Divided x is 1.8 straight forward. Then the uh, weight transfer will be equal to 2 kilo newton. Therefore, the total weight or dynamic weight, when dynamic weight on rear wheel will be that is static weight plus weight transfer. Static weight plus weight transfer. Therefore, that will be equal to static weight was. 13.65 plus weight transfer is 2 kN therefore it will be equal to 15.65 kN so this is the answer for this question hope you understand please like and subscribe to my channel